Okay, so I haven't made a vlog in a while, and I figured since I have an hour to kill that I would make one. And I didn't have an idea for one until just now. So, today I went and I gave my blood. That's why I have this bandage thing on my elbow. I also have a pretty gnarly sunburn, but whatever. I really like giving blood, and I like that I can help other people by doing so, but I have a problem with the Red Cross and the FDA when it comes to this thing. In case you didn't know, I am a huge supporter of gay rights. Like, whoa. And I find it very unfair that the FDA completely doesn't let homosexual men, or women for that matter, give blood. The FDA's um, policy on it is as follows. Men who have had sex with other men at any time since 1977, the beginning of the AIDS epidemic in the United States, are currently deferred as blood donors. This is because MSM are, as a group, at increased risk for HIV, hepatitis B, and certain other infections that can be transmitted by transfusion. While, yes, AIDS has always been associated with gay males in America, that's not just who has it anymore. It's not just a gay disease. And the fact that the FDA is excluding gay men from giving blood just seems completely irrational. Here's how I see it. So they take the blood out of your arm, and they put it in a bag, and they bring it to the hospital, and then they do 13 tests on it. They do 13 tests on every vessel or whatever amount of blood they have. 13 tests on everybody's blood. So either they're not confident in their testing abilities, or they're just bigots. Which is why it's so tough for me to go in there every time they have a blood drive, because on one hand, I have, you know, I'm saving a life, with my blood, but on the other, it's completely demeaning the rights of my friends and family and loved ones. There are so many more things to worry about in this world than good people just trying to help others by giving their blood. It doesn't, it shouldn't matter to the FDA whether a person is straight or gay or bisexual or man or woman or fat or thin. It should just be a person who wants to give blood. If they are testing it anyway, they should take it. I mean, I don't, I just, I can't fathom it. It just seems ironic that on every blood drive poster it says we're in dire need of your blood, like we need more blood, and yet they're turning down thousands of people who would willingly give their blood if they were allowed to. It doesn't make sense to me. I think that if I were a sick patient in a hospital and my life depended on getting a good blood transfusion or something to that regard, I wouldn't care if the person on the other end of that deal was gay or straight. It wouldn't matter. As long as I had good blood in my system and it was going to keep me alive, I would not give two lying fucks about their sexual orientation. So that's that. I can't, I'm going to get really mad if I continue. So give me your thoughts down there. I don't, like, bleh. Okay, bye.